So far, my experiments have all been successful. I have created three living animatronics without fail. But there is one. One that I just cannot figure out. Wait, that's it! Chum Chum, we need a brain. Ooh. Yes, just give me a second. I think I have one here somewhere. Ah, here we go. Now, if I just put this right in here, then perfect. <laughs> so, hey guys, what is going on? It's the reactor shout really loud, but it's super windy. I don't know, you, wait, what? Where did the wind go? Oh yeah, it's not actually windy. I was just playing a prank on you guys. Uh, but hey guys, what is going on? It is me, Callie, and welcome back to another video here on that channel where today I'm gonna hit you with a floss. And uh, as soon as I've done that, I'm gonna show you how to finally make the last animatronic. Well, it's not, there's a few more, so it's not actually the last one. I know, I'm sorry, but it is one of the coolest ones. Chica. Am I saying that right? Is it Chica or is it like Chica or is it like a Chica? But guys, grab your jetpacks. Let's take off and let's begin this tutorial. So, guys, once you have made it into the avatar editor, you are ready to begin the first step as per usual, which is to remove everything you are currently wearing. So, the way I do this, guys, is to come to the wearing selection and come to tuning, and then just click all of the boxes just like I did. And as you can see, I'm like not wearing anything anymore. Crazy, right? Now that you're looking incredibly naked and handsome, just like me, you're ready for the next step, which is kind of simple, guys, and that is to come to the body selection, come to scaling, click advanced, make the head scale bigger, and make the height a slight bit taller, just like that. Oh, once you've done that, come to the head selection and equip this head right here, or you can equip this one right here, which is the one I'm going for, which is called the perfection head. It is perfectly cylinder and circular and, you know, just cool. Two. Once you've changed the shape of your head to like a bowling ball, come to the face selection where you're going to want to equip a duck face, guys. I always forget the name of it, but it's this one right here. It's called the Quijibo face, a fat balding North American ape with no chin. Okay, well, that looks like a duck to me. I don't know about you guys, but uh, yeah, it looks like a duck. Next, guys, come to the color selection and click yellow like the Simpsons yellow and then click the color palette. But you're going to want to make yourself like a darker just like that. So it kind of like blends in with the color we're about to equip. Next, what you need to do is come to the wearing selection and come to pants click the custom pants box at the top left and when the flamingo god drops this box down from the sky like this input the following code guys pause the video if you need to see the code like it's literally right there on the screen you know like right there and uh yeah if you see it and you type it in press wear and it will give you these amazing pants that you can see i am wearing right now right and if that's the case then put on a shirt as well so come to shirts click custom shirts and then input the following code guys this is different than the one we just did so make sure you put in the different code which is this one right here and then press wear and then it will give you this amazing t-shirt to match you should now be looking just like this right now so next guys if you need to change the color of your body just to match the suit that we've just put on i just did and then come to the animation selection where you're going to want to equip the cartoony animation if you don't see it just search car and equip the cartoony animation following that guys we're going to now make ourselves look like Sheikah because right now let's be honest we don't don't look anything like her or any of the other animatronics so the first thing we need to do is give that duck look and the way i do that is by coming to the hat selection and simply searching duck just like that and equipping this which is called the spring duck head you see how it's spelt right there they come to tuning and just make it smaller and bring the position of it down. What you want to do is make sure the hair is like sticking out the top and that this beak is going around the mouth So if you need to then just bring it up a little bit like that and make sure the black of the mouth is sitting inside of well Your beak I guess next guys come to the face selection and just search incred like that It will only give you two options equip the one on the left Which is the incredible face mask come to tuning change the rotation So it angles it up like that and then bring the position of it to the front and bring it down kind of like this Once you've done that guys come to the face selection and now you're going to want to equip some weird eyes, which are called the Mad Scientist Goggles. I can see them right there, but if you don't see them, just search Mad, and you'll see them right there, the Mad Scientist Goggles. Equip those, go to tuning, make them smaller so that they fit inside the eyes, and then just bring them down and play about with the settings until you get them how you want them 
kind of like that. Once you've done that, guys, you want to equip the teeth for your mouth. So to do that, simply come to the hat selection and just search Om Nom like that. Equip this right here. Definitely don't equip that because if you do, then, you know, you're not going to be Sheikah. You're going to be some evil Nom monster. So make sure you equip this one right here. Come to tuning. Make it as small as possible. Change the rotation so it goes down a bit. And then bring it down and to the front just like this. Guys, pause the video if you need to copy my settings. But as long as your teeth are sitting on your mouth slightly like that, you have done a good job. Now, there's only really one thing missing, and that is some hair, because Shika has, like, this hair up the top, and the way I did that is to come to the hair selection and simply just search Popstar, just like this, and equip this hair right here, come to tuning, change the rotation of it so that it goes backwards, kind of like this, and then just bring the position of it down and uh, to the front, just like that. And guys... That is literally it. That is how you become Chica or Chica or whatever this one's called from Five Nights at Freddy's. I know, I look pretty cool, right? But uh, yes, guys, that is going to be it from me today. I just want to say that I also have a Foxy the Pirate. I have a Freddy Fazbear. And I also have a Bonnie the Bunny tutorial over on my channel if you want to go check those out right now. But if you don't and you happen to want to check something else out, I also have a ton of other tutorials too. Again, guys, thank you so much for watching to the end of this video. It truly does mean a lot to the bottom of my heart. Remember to like the video if you like the video. Hit the subscribe button. What are you waiting for? And, guys, I will see you all in the next video. Bye. Now I've got to make a golden Freddy Fazbear. This is getting crazy.